Hello and welcome back to the Darkest Dungeon. I actually recorded an episode the other day, but something happened with the audio video of it. And I defeated the Swine King on Veteran uh, with a... You'll be able to see the crew, guys. I'll just do sort by stress. Um, Maginar, Adenel, um, Grandcourt, and Drulin went out and they, they defeated the Swine King. Bit of stress, a little bit of disease... Uh, maybe we'll send Adnell. We'll get rid of that uh, the vampiric spirits. I don't know that I'm going to send any of them for any stress relief right now. We'll, I'll think about it. I, I don't want to waste the money right now. But uh, we're planning to send out uh, Dud Dudley. I've equipped uh, some items on them. All right, let's go ahead and we're going to upgrade their skills. I've already equipped uh, trinkets and stuff on them healing for the uh, healer. I gave the wounding helmet which reduces his move skill chance but increases his damage overall and then uh, this is less chance to be surprised and a more chance of surprising and then uh, Seuss I gave him uh, the blight skill chance and the stun skill chance and Dudley I gave extra damage and extra damage and accuracy. Now he'll take a little bit of extra stress but he has a stress heal on, on himself so I think we can manage that. Uh, the accuracy is good because his accuracy as the Accuracy base, as you can see from most of his hits, are, are 85, so giving him an extra 10% is pretty good, above 75 torch. So we'll try and keep the light keep the light up as much as we can. We're going to embark, and we're going to do status mayhem. Uh, we're going to go into the ruins. Uh, really, my only options are the ruins here, or we could do a medium. Paintings are good. This is a abomination uh, item, and this is just uh, the worry stone a little bit less stress. I figure we'll do a nice short short run here. Get back into things and we'll do a ruin short runs. I uh, will prov provision for this. It's been a while since I've done a ruins run. Don't know what do we need for a ruin short run. Uh, the standard food for a short run is just a stack. Uh, torches is usually eight. Uh, I don't know if I need to take an extra one or not. We'll go with eight. Shovels for a short run is usually like one, maybe two. Uh, so we'll take two. Uh, I think for anti-venom for the ruins is usually none. I don't think you need anti-venoms. Bandages can come in handy, I think, though. And uh, we'll take a couple of bandages. The medicinal in the ruins... Uh, I guess we'll buy an additional one. We want at least two keys, I think, and uh, two holy water. I think we should be good with that that setup. And let us embark into the ruins. It's just a ex small exploration one. I just want to get this group of guys up to like level four and then they'll be ready to take on uh, a boss. So oh wow that was pretty good. Uh, we just need to explore the ruins. Uh, let's go here. We don't need to go here but uh, oh, we start here so we're gonna go here. I think you're our trap guy. Nobody has any stress to start with here. All right, so what do we got here? Bookshelf. I'm pretty sure bookshelf you just read and gain or lose stuff. And we should be at 70. We'll pop a torch. Right, there's nothing here. We're going to go anyway. There's one curio. Which gives us a torch uh, and some cash, so it's kind of worth it, I guess. Uh, we'll go back and uh, let me just pick a direction. I guess we'll go that way first. Get some of our food. Uh, get our torch light up. 
We're gonna have our first battle. We should still be above 75. Yep. Ooh. Surprise! Oh, I forgot to change your ability. Oh, that, that was my bad. My bad. All right, let's go ahead and do some damage to the back guys. Let's try and stun the back guys. I don't know how well that's going to work. Oh, that worked out pretty well, actually. Uh, can stun him. Get some stuns going. And uh, I guess it doesn't matter. We'll just attack, attack the back, the front guy. Oh, they're gonna go first. Ouch. Ouch. They resisted both, so that's pretty good. Uh, yeah. Just keep damaging the back guys. This guy's gonna hurt. Yeah, I figured. And a bleed. Alright, let's go ahead. All right, this will finish off the one back guy. Go for the stun. Good. Uh, whack away. And he's dead on his next turn. Okay. All right, we'll go for a heal after this. Oh, he stunned our only, our only heal. He can heal himself though. Uh, he's dead on his turn. He will we'll go for the kill there. I'll just stun him just because why not? Go for the heal. Just because he'll die. Gently. Okay. Pop through. Um, I don't know, but I always have bad luck reading the books. Oh, okay. Not this time. Oh, I, I hit twice. Uh, oh well. My bad. So far we've had good, good books. The wound is starting to fester. The flesh around it is gray, flaking ridged, almost scale-like. As I write this, my breathing has taken on a hollow timbre and is more labored. My compatriots are laughing at me, telling me not to worry. It's just a salt mist in the air that pervades these caverns. Well, second hunger check. Oh, nothing. So yeah, I, I'm going to try and finish this game eventually, but uh, recording of it is not going to be consistent. And hopefully people will still follow along. Um, I guess I'll do some damage on him. Now I could blight the front two. Yeah, let's go for the blade on the front two. Oh, it's only the front one. Okay. I'm going to try and stun you. Hew hew! Oh, like that. Ouch. And the bleed again, of course. Nice heal. Nice dodge. Wow. Holy crits, Batman. Let's grab the stuff. Alright. 
It's been good so far. It's, this is going to be bad. No, nope. unremarkable. And nothing, huh? Well, we'll make our slow journey back as we run out of torches. Torchlight's gonna keep going down. Uh, we only have what three left? Two left? Three left? It will be okay, hopefully. Only three more rooms. Yeah, we'll pop one before this room. Get us above that 75 mark. I got two curios here. A handsome reward. Okay, let's pop a torch here that gets us to 70. We actually have to pop two. No surprise this time. That's disheartening. Get some stress because of that. All right, so let's go ahead for the stun the back row. Oh, they double dodged. Um... Let me try and stun you. It works. And uh, we'll do some damage to the back row. Ouch. That hurt. Take that. Double crits? Come on. Nice dodge. Okay, let's. Since our stun. Let's try the stun again. Alright, that's good. Finish him! Yeah, that works. Uh, let's definitely get a heal off. That wasn't great, but it's better than nothing. Oh, and I got the bleed. The big hit. Nice dodge, people. Okay, we'll. I guess we'll try and get the plague back there. All right, we'll take him out. I think he's got a pretty good stun resist. Pretty good, but maybe we can get him. Oh wow, let me send him flying. I'm gonna go for a heal. Okay, you're in the back row now, so let's get some blight on you. Uh let's go for the heal. And not stunned. I'll just do an attack. There will be no blood left for the leeches. <sighs> dodge. No dodge. Nice dodge. Dead. Oh, we ran out of room already, huh? What don't we need? Uh, well, we probably don't need the anti-venom. Alright, well, we're gonna be okay. Disarm the, tor the trap. We got no more fights. Got an extra torch anyway for us to. If we had had a fight, we'd be okay. We're gonna go to the next room just because it's it's just a trap. We can get a little bit of stress relief for the 
bounty hunter. It's down to six stress. We could go and take on. No, we're not going to do that. That's just it's a death sentence. Not sure why I kept walking. Uh, that's it. We're out of here. We're out. find whatever secrets they hold well made it like eight grand not a lot didn't really get a lot of anything out of that but that's okay ruins adventurer irrepressible cove explorer and lagophobia flawed release well Nothing really terribly bad. They None of them level to level 4, sadly. But uh, yeah, I hope you've been enjoying this look at Darkest Dungeon. I know it's been, you know, there's been like lots of time in between episodes currently. But hopefully we'll get, I'll get a few out here before uh, before I get some more games. So, and I hope you've been enjoying it. There's, I know there's a few of you that have been watching along religiously. So hopefully you do enjoy it. Idle jesters will gain a resolve level. I don't think I have too many jesters left, but I might have one or two. Um, so if I don't do anything with them, they will gain a resolve level, which is fine. But uh, yeah, we are getting to the point where we might be able to venture into the darkest dungeon, but we're not quite there yet. Uh, but this group, they hardly have any stress, so I might be able to send them out on another another adventure and get them up to like level four. At least Dudley and Seuss would hit level four, and Celia and Lizard would be close. But until next time, Delgaro.